Hello everyone, welcome to Leeds Grid. Today we are going to discuss an LRDI set based on ranking. In these types of sets, there are multiple conditions given and we need to check all the conditions to solve our questions. So just stop the video here and try to solve it. Only after solving the set, proceed with the video. Now the statement given was the sports coach of old Dermot sports team evaluated his four star players A, B, C and D on the basis of three parameters. And these are a few facts he found. Uh, no two players are equal on any of the parameters. The only one faster than Barty is the weakest. It means one parameter is the speed and the other parameter is the strength. Now the third point is the tallest one is the slowest but is stronger than crab. So the third parameter is the height. So let's just make a table first. So here is a table formed. Here the rank 1 represents the strongest person and rank 4 represents the weakest person. Similarly for rank 1 fastest and rank 4 for the slowest and so on. Now get back to the second statement. It was given the only one faster than Barty is the weakest. The only one. Only one faster than Barty. It means Barty should be at second in the fast column. So Barty should be present here. The only one faster than Barty is the weakest. Means if there is a person X at this point, then he should also be present at this point because it was mentioned the only one faster than Barty is the weakest. So the person who is faster than Barty is also the weakest person. Now the third statement is the tallest one is the slowest but is stronger than crab. Tallest one. So the tallest person can be Y, any person Y and he is the slowest but is stronger than crab. So what does this line mean? It means crab should not be the person who is the tallest or is the slowest. So B is already used here. Uh, y cannot be C. So the only places left for Y is it can be either A or D. Because B is already filled here. So B cannot be at this point. So for Y only A and D is left. Now read out the fourth condition. A is neither taller than D nor stronger than him. So it means if Y is A, then it has to be taller than D. But the condition given is A is neither taller than D nor stronger than him. So the only condition possible for Y is D. Draco should be taller. And here it will also be Draco who is the slowest. Now for X there can be two conditions. That is X can be A or it can be C. So let's just make two cases. Now let's just assume uh, one case to be A and the other case to be C. So let's just assume A here, then A will be here, C here, and then C should be here. Now if A is here, then this place is for C. And if C is here, then this place is for A. Now if we combine the third point and the fourth point, fourth point says, Every is neither taller than Draco nor stronger than him. So it means D should be stronger than A. Also the tallest one is the slowest but is stronger than Crab. The tallest person is D. So D should be stronger than C. So the maximum position for D will be 2. And the minimum position for D will be 1. In the strength column the maximum position for D will be 2. And the minimum position for D will be 1. Now D can be here at first position or D can be here. Same for the second table. Now the fifth point is one of the four is taller, faster as well as stronger than at least two others. So C cannot be that person because he is the lowest in the strength column. D cannot be that person because he is the slowest in second column. And also A cannot be that person because his rank is third in the speed column. So B should be that person in the second table. So B will be here and B can be here or D can be there also for first rank B or D can be there so for the third rank only A is left here so this is one of the table formed now check for the first table to satisfy fifth point A cannot be that person because A is present here D cannot be that person because D is present here C cannot be that person because C is present there so B should be the person who is taller, faster as well as stronger than at least two others. So position for B will be here. And also B or D will be here. Or B or D will be here. Both the conditions are possible for both the tables. 
now if a is present here then this position is for c now this is the table formed no more conditions left so let's just proceed with the questions now the first question was who would rank second on the basis of height the first ranker being the tallest second on the basis of height is b in both the tables so our answer will be bati that is second option now move to the second question if the four players ran a race and the two winners then competed against each other in a tug of war who would emerge the winner ran a race ran a race it means the person who are fastest that is c and b in the second table and a and b in the first table the two winners will be a and b and c and b in the second table then competed against each other in a tug of war it means the competition of strength is there the rank of b is greater than c in the second table and rank of b is greater than a in the first table as well so bati should be the winner in the tug of war competition so our answer will be first part now move to the third question now who is the slowest d is slowest d is slowest in the first table and d is slowest in the second table as well so our answer to this question will be draco that is third part now the fourth question is if crab does not have the same rank on any of the two parameters then who is the weakest it means first case is eliminated because c is having the same rank in two parameters so first case is eliminated here now we need to check for the second case c is present here so in the tallest column c should be present here and if c is present there then a should be present here now it is asking who is the weakest the weakest one is crab so third part will be our answer so this is it for this particular set i hope you like the video for more such videos like share and subscribe our youtube channel thanks and happy learning